You guys ready for the granddaddy total? George put all the appraised jewelry out here on the dinner table. Hails low! Hope you're doing well today. Today we're back in the $400 unit where yesterday we found gold jewelry, appraised gold jewelry, and we've just begun to just touch and scrape the surface of this thing. This is an incredible unit, and who knows, who the hails knows what else we're gonna find today. Let's dig in. Back at the warehouse, ready to dig in and find out what else is in this unit. This is probably a piece of furniture that was in the living room or something along those lines. Again, what we know so far, from this individual. This is a $400 unit. We bought it in Norwalk, Ohio. And the individual was a female and uh, she loved horses and no next to Ken. So here's some Christmas items. Uh, Santa's coming and Santa's coming. Let me see. There's something in here. There's definitely something in here. Oh, whoa. Guess I wasn't the only one shocked. This is not a living room drawer by any stretch of the imagination. This is, uh, we just found the 50 shades of gray drawer. That's what we just found. No way. Oh my goodness, frisky feather duster. I got, oh. Feathers are flying everywhere right now. All right, Adam and Eve, top 60. Oh man, alive, there are feathers everywhere. Uh, looks like gummy lifesavers. Yeah, these look like gummy lifesavers. I should actually, I should try and eat one of these. If there was an expiration date, I would. But I don't even, they're probably still good, so you guys are gonna wanna see me eat that. After that first drawer, no telling what's gonna be in the second drawer. Actually, actually, yep, yep, it's pretty, pretty, pretty telling what is in the second drawer. We got balloons, but look, the expiration date, these aren't expired, so you can eat these balloons. So 2020, that's not bad. Throw those over there. Um, well, you can see the collection there. We'll just set that up there. Ooh. Whoa, 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 whoa. Um, let's just say somebody was a mushroom collector. We'll just go with that. Throw that over there. I can, can't get that out of my head now. Okay. Uh, Magboy, anybody know what Magboy is? This is something made in Japan. I don't know. These like dice, like Dungeon and Dragon dice. These might be specialized Dungeon and Dragon dice for for uh, RPG games, role-playing games. So maybe something like that. These might. This would be my guess. Um. Oh man. What is going on? All right, we gotta be careful here. Whatever, this thing is saturated. I have no idea why. All right, whatever is in here, it is, it is stuck to everything. You don't wanna see what that green thing is. All I can tell you is the Incredible Hawk wasn't all that incredible. <laughs> Oh my goodness, this is so gross. Oh, whoa, what's this? What's that? Anybody know what those are? Is this like, this is what you throw in with your dishwasher? Oh wait, that's supposed to be attached there. These are like those cleaning balls for your dishwasher? That'd be my guess. How many do you need? My good. Okay, I, I got to get out of here and go get a shower and go get George from radiation. 
George is back from radiation. Howdy, y'all. You ready to find out how bad you lost in her competition? Well, tell me what you found today so far. Just stuff. Stuff? Like what? Define stuff. Garbage. <laughs> Just kind of like your unit. So I, uh, I grabbed... <laughs> I just, um, I figured that furniture is probably not where it's at, and we're going to start going through garbage bags. Ready? I'm ready. Let's do this. Dig in! Good to see you have gloves on. Always. Always have to have gloves on. Uh, this is about the, what, 15th? Oh! Usually it's garbage, but... This is good. This is tack. We won't have to edit this clip out because it's garbage. So this is about, what would you say, the 15th bag we've gone through? and Yeah, usually it's stuff that uh, nobody ever wants no to see. No one really wants to see. So, okay. We definitely found tack. We thought this was actually going to be in, the, um, in that trunk from yesterday. If you haven't seen that, you'll want to check that out. Lots of cool stuff in there. We found all kinds of cool things. Uh, some of the too? yeah, some of the leather is rough. But yeah, there's the bit. Yeah, multiple horse items. I'm, oh. Obviously, we know. There's some coins. Really? Yeah. Look at that, guys. We found money yesterday too. There's some more. This is just randomly in the garbage bag. Yeah. So All right, we'll we check better these. set that aside. They're common coins, they go in our five gallon bucket. Some packing tape, we can always use packing tape for when we ship things out. Wind chime, looks like receipts at the bottom. And a lunch box of junk. What's all that? Yeah, you dig in the bottom of this and I'll look in here. Alright, we got... This is just... Like from the medicine cabinet. Anti-diarrhea. Bee complex. Sponge. Oh my gosh, I found more jewelry. More jewelry. Huh? Get that out of the way. <laughs> Jewelry. Is it, it appraised? Like it's appraised it is. This is appraised stuff again. Oh my goodness. Look at this. This is the appraised stuff again. Can I take my gloves off? Yellow gold this? diamond. Okay, wait, hold a second. Let's reposition. Let's reposition the entire camera. Okay. Holy cow. This is all appraised. This is so ridiculously Did you say random. Take look, my look. Off? Look, yeah, take your gloves off. Look, this one says $900. This one, maybe just in this bag. Let's check. This is so ridiculous. Wow. How in the world? Do you think she sold at like a uh, flea market? Oh my goodness, look at this ring. Flea market? No, I think this has got to be her collection. Babe, look at this ring. It's 14 karat. Look, all of this stuff is real. That's really pretty. Wow. Wow. Did that one have a label? I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Well, I'm sure it is. You just got to find the corresponding label. All right, this is... Yeah, 14 karat yellow gold opal pendant. How much was that one valued at? Total value, 225. All right, now remember these appraisals. I can't see the carrot on that one. These appraisals are old appraisals. This looks like opal too. She definitely had a thing for opal. Wow. All right, so this bag has $900 on it. Here's so, is, uh, a pair of 14 karat gold earrings. The value is $50. Babe, here's the ring. Five opals, $400. Right there, that's that first ring I showed you, $400. Nice. Is that the one you read to me or? Yeah. How did I get the paper back in my hand? I think there was two. There's two of them? No, that one says 225, babe. So that's for something else. Hmm. Oh my goodness, this is crazy. Here's something in here for $300. Okay, so this bag here, I don't want to put that I don't want to put that ring on the ground. That bag is in a garbage bag. It Hold a second. 
just wrap your head around this. Okay, so all this jewelry is in a Samsonite bag, which was in a fridge lunch bag, which was in a garbage bag. All right, I'm gonna hand that off to you. All right, there's, there's, this thing is full. Okay, this thing has $40 on it. And I don't see any markings on that one. Let's check the necklace. This definitely feels like gold. And yes, you can the tell with... the feel of gold. Once you've done this enough, you can tell just by touching it. All right, I'm gonna set this aside. There's so much. Okay, this is, these are gold, gold earrings, gold round hammered. This had to be professionally done. This says $50 it's out earrings. on the baggie. Total value 150. Okay, this says 75 for these gold earrings. She had to have it appraised professionally. Okay, 400 for the set. So let's see, oh my god, I cannot freaking believe this. We're gonna have to add up the total. Babe, look story. at this. That's really pretty. I paid 400 for the unit. I outbid you, you were at three <laughs> something. I outbid you and got the unit. This one thing, $400 and who knows? Here, here, hold on to that. Oh man, alive. All right, here's another set of earrings appraised for 175. Yellow gold amethyst. 125 on the bag, 175 appraisal. So maybe appraisal value is higher than resale value? I'm not sure. Here's a uh, 10 karat gold ring with a ruby center valued at 200. Two hundred dollars. Oh my goodness! How in the world? This was in a garbage bag. This was in a garbage bag. We don't even. We we. This is so insane. We we spend hours upon hours, fourteen karat gold videoing. This takes so much time, and most of it gets cut out to give you a show that you can watch in about twenty-five minutes. So, all of the bags we've already been through. It's garbage. I mean, it's not garbage. We're donating to Goodwill. It's clothing and stuff. And then this was in there. This is insane. All right. Appraisal, $30. Earrings, $25. This is crazy. I have never, ever seen anything like this in my life. In a garbage bag? I'm going to admit it. You won. You won this time. Oh, now she admits it. <laughs> now she admits it, guys. If you haven't seen our original challenge, we'll put it in the comments. I think these are pearls. Yep. There they are. Okay, I gotta... Baby, can you put... This is 150. Can you put that... Yeah, I want to keep it all together. Luster B quality. Okay, the pearls... All right, these are white pearls that I just showed you, white pearls. There's the size, B quality, good luster. Okay, so all of that. I'm gonna hand these over to you. These are 14 karat yellow gold with rose gold, heart-shaped. Uh, total value is 175, according to this. <laughs> oh my goodness, I feel like. You hit the jackpot, you definitely hit a This is mine. insane. It went from stinky storage unit of rotten food to a gold And mine. there was there was a ton of rotten food in the freezer. It was so bad we just scrapped the freezer. And there was this there was insane. onions growing hair. Yeah, there's boxes with onions growing. We have probably I don't did we have anything good in those boxes we were gonna show them or we did probably gonna edit that out too, huh? Yeah. You guys don't wanna see that. Okay, let's find out what this total is. This is crazy. Here's another $400 ring. Nice. Yes! Yes! Is that one white gold? Oh my goodness. Look at this. Look at this. This is just plain dumb luck. 
Is that? Yeah, it's gold. This one's gold. Nice. With the star. Onyx ring star. That's okay, I'm gonna. Nice. Can I hand this off? Yeah. Here's the next one. The this next is one crazy. is a pair of 14 karat, two tone gold ruby and diamond earrings. Total value 225. Holy cow! I love how everything's labeled for us. It had to be professionally appraised. Two twenty-five. It has, she had to have taken it in, had everything appraised, and then she cut up the slips of paper. Here's something for two ninety-five. We'll have to find out. It's not in the bag. Something for three seventy-five. Wait. Something for three hundred and fifty. Topaz. I, we may not have everything. Is we don't know. This is just incredible. This is this is this just blowing my is mind. This is just blowing my mind. Okay, 150 pearl earrings, gold pearl earrings right there. 150 appraisal. This looks like a silver chain yeah she's got twenty dollars written on it silver chain this is just wild here there's another one down here maybe this will be the granddaddy big one there's a star in it whatever it is it's a necklace I'll read the appraisal no I can't you get it them. I can't get it my hands are shaking this is just too crazy this is like Jason a thrift traders stash he found this is a pendant this is a 10 karat white gold eastern star post matron pen total value 375 375 this was in a garbage bag isn't that crazy people store their things in this is so insane places all right no 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 don't don't let the appraisals blow away we need those the wind is blowing we got to turn this off and get this cleaned up that was such a huge score that we hurried up and went through the unit. Whoever packed this unit did a good job of labeling everything, and we came across this. So but let's hopefully we, we find more. We story. also have to say that when we loaded this, we never saw it. So sometimes we were taking two or three or four different totes and boxes in at a time just trying to get out as fast as possible. So all of a sudden, George sees this, and... My heart's Bam. pumping. You ready? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, is this photo albums? Do? I don't know. Is it photo albums or? Let's start off with the small one first. No, that's a that's a jewelry box. You hear that? All right. What do you got? Oh. Oh my goodness. Cleveland Indian pins. Okay, so that's not. We don't have appraisal stickers in here. This looks here. like... I took my gloves off. I'll open it. Okay. Keep looks like the box right there. Costume jewelry. Look at it. Okay. See that there? Silver. So even old belt buckles. Like this is an old belt buckle. Those are silver. So there's a silver and gold collection in here. Oh my goodness. I can't believe this. Okay. Now... We gotta be completely and totally honest with them. A, a lot of times, I tell you over and over, if a unit has a mattress, walk away. If it has a funky smell, walk away. Ah, uh, man, these are tangled. And this unit had a funky smell. I bet that's gold. And it had a mattress with a stain on it. And I still bid on it. And the only reason why I bid on it, guys, is because George was bidding on it. Because you're always trying to beat me. Yeah, I was you're trying to beat trying to her. Up me. <laughs> so it just goes to show you that I am not right. It's all dumb luck sometimes. Profiling helps your luck, but this is complete and total dumb luck. Complete dumb luck on this unit. It's tangled pretty good. We goof around. We goof around. You think that's real silver? I don't see the markings on that one, but I bet you some of the gems are real. Let's, let's look in the next one because this is going to take us forever to get it undone. I'm sure there's going to be valuable stuff. We goof around that we're in a competition, and we were in a competition, but never in the world did we think we were going to score with this much gold and silver. Oh! oh. I'm going to hold on to this. Okay. All right. Holy cow. 
Do you see all this? Wow, that definitely looks like real silver. All right, let's see what we got. Holy cow. Oh man. Yep, we got the markings. Okay. There's more over here. Yeah, just set it. Look at how old some of this is. It just needs cleaned up. There's the markings. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. And you guys tell us all the time some costume jewelry is worth just as much mm -hmm. as the gold and silver. I don't see any markings on this, but... That looks cool, though. It's a really beautiful bracelet. This... This doesn't look like real pearls. See the string in between there? That's just string. But... Oh, that says Jostens. Okay, so that's a senior pin. There's another one. It's Is a little it gold? bit thinner. Wow. This looks like costume jewelry. Costume jewelry. Okay, I got a bag here of clips. Pins. Did you look through these already? I looked through those ones. Let's just see if any of these clips have markings. Yep. Haha, <laughs> yes. Where'd you find Yes, them? more gold. More nice. gold. These pins right here. Ah, oh, this is so incredible. You did yeah, this so is another this right? is another gold stash. Ah, oh, wow. Wow. Oh man. This looks and feels like real gold. Okay, this looks like oriental. Oh look, there's matching earrings. And it is... It's marked. But what is it marked? I can't... Can you guys tell what that's marked? If... If you can tell what it's marked, let us know in the comments. Does that say Italy? Something. Some of you jewelry These are experts up. will know. We're going to have to untangle them, but they're matching whoa, necklaces. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Look at all this. I bet you there's some real pearl in here. Wow. Okay, so if you keep the bad stuff in a garbage bag, you, you probably keep the good stuff in the jewelry box, right? You would think. My goodness, look, there's... Looks like a diamond in there. Right in there. This is insane. That's Another beautiful. Another beautiful necklace. This looks wow. real. I don't see any markings, but it looks and feels real. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Now, you know what? We're going to get comments. Do these, does he ever stop saying wow? I would like to meet the person that finds a score like this who just sits there straight-faced and goes, <laughs> <laughs> And that doesn't get excited. Yeah, exactly. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm not excited. Um, I'm going to make, I'm going to make $5,000 just on jewelry. I'm not excited at all. Yeah, that's just a normal day. I guess that is kind of normal for us anymore, but <laughs> I don't care. I still get excited. I love the hunt. This is silver. Yeah, yeah we got more silver. This Look looks at silver. this. This is definitely silver. You got more silver. You're not in the shot. Down, over, right there. Bam. Wow. Happy birthday to George on Friday. <laughs> Holy good cow. Oh, babe, look. Look at this little watch. Did you see? Look at this down here. Oh, no, there's more than one watch. Look at this, guys. Okay. All I know is some watches can be worth a ton. And some aren't worth anything. I don't know anything about them. 
Icy Profits just found a $20,000 watch. Nice. Go Icy. I'd have send them to watches, have them appraise them for me. Let's look at the back. Okay, that's 10 karat gold. Nice. And this one is, can't tell. It's so hard to try and read through the camera. Well, this one looks like it's the oldest one, and this one is a gold outer. Wow. This looks like a real gold bracelet. And I found this really cool charm. I think we have a gold chain in here, too. This is wild. I think we got a gold chain in there. Oh, look at this brooch. Boy, we need, we honestly, we have got to find a jewelry expert local. Do any of our fans, subscribers, viewers, hey, even the haters, can you suggest somebody who could do a good appraisal and maybe even full out purchase of, if I had to guess, we probably have $20,000 worth of gold and silver we jewelry used to have at home. Someone, but she retired. She retired. She's out of business now. So we have so much. We want somebody who will buy all the gold, all the silver, and all the costume jewelry. This now, looks like it could be real silver, but it just needs to be cleaned up. If you go, oh, I'll buy it for you, Jeremy. I'll give you $400. Don't bother. <laughs> we want a serious, we're in this for a business. We live and die by this. We want a serious buyer. If anybody knows the best place to take them, look at this. There's a moose on there. That's got to be gold. Did you go through this down here? No, not yet. I've been setting them aside. What's that? That looks like real gold. It's a pen. Wow. Yep, gold and this is gold. Okay. These tie tacks. <laughs> oh man. This is awesome. Look at that moose. Wow. Strike out cancer. Oh, that's appropriate, babe. Look at that. Where? Eagles Cancer Fund Strike Out Cancer. Nice. Here, I'll get out of your way. This definitely is oh, silver. Wow. On the back, it says sterling. Oh, it's See so that? pretty, too. There's a clip on earring. Babe, I think there's another box down here. There is. You there's think? another box oh, down yeah. here. So that's Did it. we Look go that through all that? I think so. All right, I'm going to put this on pause. We're going to fill this back up, and we're going to see what's down in here. This is a uh, incredible Wednesday. Okay, George moved the other jewelry box off the top. Okay, what if we do oh, this? Oh, that one's here. heavy. Uh, let me move this stuff. Yeah, here, let's create like a tabletop. That's what, oh, okay, that was good. I was just going to flip it over. All right, set that down. Are you ready? We, let me go up a little bit. Okay. I'll take it up. And then... Yeah, right there. And... Bam! Yeah! Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't God. believe this. This is a $400 unit. With a nasty mattress that stunk because oh of all the rotten gosh. food in the freezer. Oh, wow. So oh. this looks like... Oh, this is just insane. Do you know what I'm feeling right now, baby? What are you feeling? I'm feeling... Lucky. Holy cow. I'm not sure what that is, but that might be gold on the back there. Is this... I think that's um, blush. Blush. For your cheeks. You can't make me blush. Unless we're in front of your mom and she's asking me when I'm going to marry you, then <laughs> that'll make me blush a little bit. Yeah, there you go. That's a bone, a rib bone, right? Yeah, that looks like a rib bone. Beads. Wow. 
Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, some kind of... Some clip-on earrings. Whoa, look at this piece. I wouldn't even know where to look for markings. I mean, I think this is just costume jewelry. But, how do you know for sure? That's, that's why we need an expert. See, we know something about, a little bit of something about a, a whole lot of everything. So, that's what we want. little penguin with the stone in the middle. It's a that's pen. Cool. It's cute. And then we rely on experts to tell us everything that we don't know. So we know enough to buy. Look at that. I wonder if that's real bone. Pieces are missed. Oh, here's some of the pieces. This is just insane. Oh, you know what? <laughs> There's more. Oh, There's going to be even hidden. more. Look at this. Somebody took a seahorse and turned it into a pin. That's cool. We found another seahorse yeah. in, a, uh, in a it was in a pack cigarette case. Yeah. <laughs> that was what? Last fall? There's some more earrings. What the Wow. Yes, wow. What a score. Okay. There's another piece here. That looks like real silver. Wow. That's because it's marked. Yeah! It is silver? Nice. Here, do you want to put this on your teeth and rub them and see if it's real? <laughs> that one. That one doesn't look real to me, does it to you? This is just wild. Can you believe this? You seriously hit the mother load. Oh, look at that. We have a dag. I'm a little jelly. We have a dog tag of somebody. This is just wild. You think I hit the mother load now? You should have been hurt earlier today. Uh, what did you find? Stuff. The stuff. <laughs> You're not gonna tell me. Is that another sapphire, or what was, the, what was she collecting? No, that's not the same stone. It's pretty, whatever it is. Should we see what's down below? Yeah. Is the rest just all costume? Well, I, I don't know. Like I I guess I'm just dying to look down below. I want to see if there's any more appraised pieces. All right, let's look down below. Three, Dun. two, mm. Dun. Ooh. Okay, you're going to keep going through that? Yeah. Okay, she's going through that top drawer. Let's see what... That sounds good. Little gallery. It's a seashell. Let's see if we can find... this all back in here. All right, I'm gonna set this back down in there. Oh, it looks like, looks like we have a gold chain with a pearl. Yeah, that definitely looks like real gold. Oh, that's, yeah, that's absolutely real gold. And okay, so here's what they always say, is you take the pearl and you rub it on your teeth if and it's gritty, it's real. Yep, it's gritty. <laughs> it's very gritty. So we have gold and pearl right there. Oh, I love this. Oh, how does it get any better? What is this? Look at this, sweetheart. There's a box with... Okay, you ready? Yeah. I have got to be careful. It's so old. All right, and... You think that's a jewelry cleaner? I don't know. Like a cloth or something? I'm not sure what it is. This might be another one. Matching box. Yeah, oh, same yep. thing. Let's open that. You're right, it is the same thing. Let's see if it's the same. Same thing. There's like a, there's an imprint in here. 
I don't know. I'm not as smart as most YouTubers. I don't know. Oh, wow. What is that? Look at this. Zippo? This is a New York Empire State Zippo. No, it's not a Zippo. It is a Ritz. I found a 14 karat white gold band. Oh, let's see it. Wow. And it's engraved in the band. Is that Elvish? One ring to rule them all. Looks like Elvish to me. Baby, I think that's Elvish. I think you found the one ring. <laughs> I'm invisible now. I'm invisible now. <laughs> I'm back. There you go. You're so silly. Look at this lighter. It says Ritz on the bottom. I wonder if Zippo made it, though. Whoa, look at this. What's this? Is this like an old? Oh, hi guys! Those, those compact mirrors. This looks like a makeup mirror. You guys look beautiful today. You guys look gorgeous. Mm, looking, you're looking hails good today. Yeah, look at that. Me. Yeah, I showed that one already. What about this? Uh, I didn't look at that yet. Another lighter. Oh, it's a lighter. What's cool it say lighter. on the bottom? Bronson can't just huh. Can you read that? They'll be able to read it when Bronson, they... world's greatest lighter. When they have it on the big screen or their phone, they'll be able to read it. Oh <laughs> what do you think's in here? More jewelry. Hopefully more appraised gold. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this is this is the last of it? Yeah. Well, maybe the last we haven't found we have we've got three, four more days to still go in this trailer. It's a huge unit. Okay. <gasps> Bam! What is it? Look that at that. That looks real. like gold. Yeah, that looks real. Babe, that's a locket. Here, can you hold this. that? Let's see if we can open it. Look at that. It's a gold locket. It's wow. Gold. Yeah, without a doubt. Here, let me see if I can give them a close-up. How cool is that? That looks like gold around that. Yeah, around a talon. Wow. Wow. Oh, this is a costume. E-M-D. What do you think that stands for? Mm -hmm. I think it stands for emptied. <laughs> and we got a big L. You guys know what that stands for, right? Love. Love. Jinx. You owe, you owe me, me a soda. A pop. This, this feels real. Oh, look at that. It's got a little... Look at that in the middle. Gem in the middle. Oh, wow. Wow. Oh my goodness. Okay, we got AA meeting tonight. We got auctions. We got auction anonymous tonight. So they're never going to believe this. We got to tell them about this tonight. That's awesome. They're never, ever going to believe this. All right, you ready to. You want to keep digging or are we going to go home for auctions anonymous? Yeah, we got to set up for tonight's live. All right, let's do this. This is just crazy. You guys ready for the granddaddy total? George put all the appraised jewelry out here on the dinner table. So it's, it's just, it's, it's flowing, it's everywhere. And not only that, she actually calculated all the appraisals. She got more of the gold and the jewelry and I mean, it, she's just got it everywhere. It's, it's everywhere right now. So uh, the granddaddy of appraisal value that we know of, that's on paper, $8,485! Oh, 